You're such an asshole. Cold snowy Minnesota, how you guys doing? The old captain is snowed in. We're, we got a foot, I think, and it's still coming down. Ain't even dark yet. Um, Aaron, uh, this is an email from my pre-med, pre-physician's assistant students. I want a short answer on this. I don't, don't you to tell me, to, I don't want you to tell me, I think is what you meant to write. I don't you to tell me to do engineering. I'm going to be a physician's assistant. That's a fact. I love this profession. I just finished my prereqs. Now I'm deciding whether to major in biology or neuroscience. I'm leaning towards neuroscience as I have an extreme intellectual interest in the nervous system. I don't want to hear your bullshit and how useless these majors are. I know that they are very useless if you only major in them with no plan of schooling after. They're perfect for pre-physician assisted school. I've shadowed seven PAs and I love the autonomy that they have and how much money they make. The PA profession is growing in its popularity. People are starting to see that they can practice medicine in six years of total schooling compared to doctors in 11 years. Yeah, I <clears throat> I wouldn't become a doctor. I would not become a doctor. I'm a hard-ass worker. I have a 3.8 GPA. I'm a 21-year-old male with debt-free college, all paid for with scholarships. I'm a first-generation college-born student with a low-income family. Moved here from Europe before I was born. I enjoy working on cars as I currently drive a 2016 car that I bought, damaged off of auction, and fixed up myself. Good job. That's... See, I don't have that level of um, all mechanics. I can't do, like, body work. I don't have the tools to do it. Uh, and I also don't have the skill. But, yeah, man, if you if you get, get that good, you can go to the auctions and get yourself a piece of car. You can get a, a relatively new car and fix it up. Last year, I fixed up the 2015 car. I made twice the amount I paid for it when I sold it. Why don't you do that? Flipping, flipping cars is a fun gig. I will never make payments on a car, though. It's a stupid-ass idea. Anyway, I work a college athlete. You see that I work hard, and I'll save your bullshit from telling me it's pointless that I'm considering bio and neuroscience and help me decide between the two. I plan on going to physician-assisted school through the military, by the way. I love working on cars, so mechanical engineering was in the back of my mind. Uh, being a mechanic and mechanical engineer is a little bit different, so I bet that makes you happy. But I love the medical field. I just hate watching your videos and hearing you bash on a biology degree because, because dude, for every one of you, there probably is a thousand biology majors, or would-be biology majors, that aren't going to go on to med school or physician assistant school or become a nurse practitioner. I kind of like Mr. Johnson in high school. He was my bio. I like, I like science. And they go major in biology. One of the smartest guys I know major in biology. Guess what he's doing? Teacher. Fucking teacher. But I, I'm going to continue to bash on biology-only degrees. Like, if you don't go on to grad school, you damn right. Same thing with psychology. If you go get your doctorate, you can make some damn good money in practice. But if you... Yeah, I got to tell it, you guys babysit, and I like the children. And I think I'm good with children, even though I'm a child myself. So I'm going to make you a child psychologist. I, at the age of 17, and having everything paid for, Tina the Suburbanite Princess, I know enough to consult wise old men and women about their mentality and mental health because I just care about their children. Do you realize how badass the PA career is? I'm, I'm imagining it's badass. You 100,000, I looked it up. Two years after undergrad and boom, you're practicing medicine, making 100,000 a year. Good, yeah. Go, oh, dude. Wish I did that. I did not. Love your videos, man. Keep it up. You're a huge help to a lot of people. I read your book and loved it. About three other copies that gifted them to their friends. Awesome. That is what everybody should do. Right there. That's everybody go buy all my books and three copies and give it. We'll make it like Jesus in the Bible. Hey, have you heard the, the word of Aaron? What is it? Fuck. And sometimes ass. Sometimes ass too. Yes, that's the New Testament of the Clary Bible. All right. Uh, best and I won't mention your name. All right. Do, do ne by, uh, neurology. Do neurology. If it, it it ultimately does not matter what you major in because you're going to go on a, a physician assistant. But since you have more of an intellectual interest in that, that's exactly what I would do is do neurology. And, and additionally, I think it would just be way more intellectually fascinating than biology. I mean, oh, meiosis, mitosis, and uh, chromosomes, and uh, asexual reproduction, and Mendel's splitting of the beans, or whatever the monk was. So the peas, the peas. He did the peas. And, oh, no, we go to a Petri dish. Uh, I would totally do neurology. Because you see, well, one, you have an interest in it. Uh, two, it just seems to be a much more interesting subject. And then, um, 
who knows, maybe down the road, you, you, you know, neurology would be a really good um, undergrad, I think, to truly understand the human mind, because I don't think we can understand it, but if you want to understand it from a chemical standpoint, a literal empirical standpoint, not fucking Freud or Young or whatever fucking dipshit they got out now. Uh, well, you see, we have a theory. Uh, none of us studied science or English or uh, chemistry or anything like that. And, well, it's, it, it's all based on on the wind. Well, if it was based on your mother's genitalia, then I think it's based on the wind. It's called wind theory. It's not behavioral, cognitive, or, or anything. It's wind theory. All right, that's it. There's your answer. Neurology, no problem. All right, we'll see you guys later. Toodles.